Welcome back. We just found out another breaking news sexual harassment claim now against Congressman John Conyers. He's apparently accused of using government resources to fly women in with whom he was having affairs. As, as these, these stories are actually coming out during the show. They're coming out so fast and furious. So I had to update you on that. And another absolutely crazy story coming out of a university or college, and this one out of Dartmouth College, uh, and I graduated from Dartmouth just a few years ago. Uh, on February 2nd, the college is scheduled to hold a forum called What's Up With White People? The event will feature Temple University sociologist Matt Ray, and he plans to provide a, quote, field guide for, quote, the different types of white people and how you can learn to spot them in their natural habitats. Sounds like the Mutual of Omaha's Wild Kingdom. Dartmouth released a statement saying it's committed to robust debate and told Fox News that the Professor Ray does not represent the views of the college. Joining us now for reaction from L.A. is Tariq Nasheed, a film producer who also bills himself as an anti-racism strategist. All right, take it away, Tariq. How is this? And we don't know what exactly is going to happen in this, but you've got kind of a summary. Right. How is this not going to foment more racial division since it's based on, quote, whiteness? Um, I think that the professor should have worded it differently. Now, I do disagree with what's up with white people as the title, because white people are not the problem. And I don't like to paint everybody with one broad brush. You have white people and you have white supremacists. And I think that it should have been entitled, what's up with white supremacy, or how can we dismantle and understand white supremacy? So the whole thing of painting all white people with a broad brush, I definitely disagree with that. But it's a very interesting topic if we want to talk about the ins and outs and how systematic white supremacy Supremacy dominates all areas of activity. So white, so it's your contention that white supremacy dominates all areas of activity. Yes, ma'am. All every yeah. every area of activity between human beings: labor, law, entertainment, sex, war, politics, religion, sports? and that's the dominant. How about that's the domineering system. Yes. How about yes, oh, sports? So the absolutely. NFL, Look the at NFL and the NBA is dominated by white supremacists. How to explain that? Yes, because the you have um, white team owners who say that their teammates or their, their team players are inmates and slaves. Donald Sterling even referred to his players as slaves. And look at what, how they're being treated now. They're protesting non-justice, and they're getting blacklisted from teams. So that just shows and proves that sports is even they're, dominated, ultimately, by systematic white supremacy. So what would your solution be to that? Would you think that there should be a mandatory distribution of ownership assets based on percentage uh, ethnicity or race in the country and kind of do it in a kind of fanned out panoply of proportionality? Well, the thing is how white supremacy works, it's all about maldistributing the resources and it's all about passing those maldistributed resources down through lineages. So we have to talk about redistributing those, um, those resources that are deserving to the people who are supposed to get it. Um, systematic white supremacy, it works based on deception, it works through propaganda, and that's something that we have to talk about and we have to flesh out. I want to replace the system of white supremacy with justice, because not only do we get it when it comes to resources, in the criminal justice system, it's a racially biased system. So it, all across the board, it's a conversation that we should have naturally on how we remedy so, and replace right. the system of white supremacy okay. with justice. Yeah, I, I, I get your point, but mm -hmm. so my answer is the solution. So you believe it should, should it be a monetary right. payout? Should it be monetary plus land or plus business ownership? I'm just trying to get the solution straight. <laughs> And, and I've been on solutions for a long time, and we've been trying to figure out how do we um, remedy systematic white supremacy. Now, when we try to get land as black people, when we try, I have an idea. It's called well, hard work, uh, ma'am. The uh, content of your character. I are let you, you saying speak that? Are you saying time. that black people don't do hard work? No, I'm talking Laura, about. Are you saying that black people don't uh, do hard nice, work? Nice try, nice trick. <laughs> I'm saying everybody. But you just work said hard, that. You said friend. black people don't do hard work. The reason why you have all the resources yeah. maldistributed yeah, into that's the dominant exactly society is black people. My friend, that's not that, at all that is what, what I you said. said and straight ahead, you know it isn't. That's the game you play. 